Ready, go! Breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. Obasanjo shocks Tinobu. Obasanjo shocks Tinobu. To my dear listeners from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read today's news. If truly wish Nigeria well, Sacrifice your ambition and give a younger person chance to salvage this sinking nation. Obasanjo tells Tinobu during closed door meeting. If truly you wish Nigeria well, sacrifice your ambition and give a younger person chance to salvage this sinking nation. Obasanjo tells. Tinobu during closed door meeting. If truly you wish Nigeria well, sacrifice your ambition and give a younger person chance to salvage this sinking nation. Oba Sojo tells Tinobu during closed door meeting. If truly you wish Nigeria well, sacrifice your ambition and give a younger person chance to salvage this sinking nation. Obasanjo tells Tinubu during closed door meeting. So, my dear listeners, from wherever you're listening from, to my dear listeners. I must really say Obasanjo has really made a good comment here because personally, I actually don't know um, what, these, um, what these people are finding, what they are actually looking for. That all they know about is just about their selfish interest. Why would um, um, Tinubu who is fighting for his, for his health be the one going about saying he wants to go for a presidency? Do we still want another Buhari in this country? Some of that after he emerged as the president of the country, a one-time session would be spent in America. And I said that these people, pastorally, once they, once, once they come out that they want to, they want to, they, they, they actually want to um, emerge as the president, they want, they, are going, they want to contest for this certain post, there's this question we should be asking them. Though we know they will lie, but there should be, Another way we, we can get these people because obviously I didn't I didn't see any future in Tinobu. I didn't see any future in Atiku. As a Yoruba boy, I think the next person and I think the person that would actually make this country go to this um that that would that would take this country to the next level is Peter Lobby. Because me looking at even 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 while they are talking, you would actually see there 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 is there is this brilliancy in their talks. Whenever they are talking, you, you, can, you can easily judge it from their words that this certain person wants, um, wants a future. We can't imagine when Tinobu is saying, uh, tell all the people you go to farm, make cassava. We all, we all know that Nigeria, Nigerians are good about agriculture. But is that the only thing? He never made mention of education. He didn't talk about a, a good education. This, this is the sixth month the students have been at, the, stu, the, the students, the Nigerian university students have been on strike. What has Tinubu personally himself done to that? About this in insecurity that is going on in this country, has Tinubu ever come out to condemn such act? They are not talking about, they are not talking about uh, the bad roads, the bad governance, there is bad electricity. We're getting light, having, having, having electricity supply just once in a week, twice in a month. Does that make any sense at all? Are, people are suffering about these things. 
What about people that people that people that are not people that are not um financially buoyant enough to get themselves a powerful generator? And what if you have a generator? You can't if you can't fuel your generator, there's no how you can use your generator. What about the people that are not that that, that do not have the power to 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 use the generator? In fact, petroleum server as as is even cost. They they want to make this country just for the rich and not for the poor. And this cannot be like that because not everybody is successful. We need to help those people that are not successful to be successful. You people are successful already. Then you need to help people under you to success to to uh, to succeed through you. But I didn't. I, I actually didn't see future. If the future about these people, your children are not schooling in this country. I'm not even sure if any of your families are in this country. Your children, they, they are not in this country. They, 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 are, they, they actually went abroad to study. How does that make any sense? Things are not getting any better in this country. These people are, 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 make, are making we Nigerians to suffer day by day. The poor can't go to the market to buy whatever he or she wants. The poor cannot send he or, he, his, his or her children to school because they can't send them to, to a better school because they actually feel um, they didn't have the, um, they, they are not financially buoyant to send their children to school. Then what do they do? They send their children walking on the street, selling all these petty, 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 uh, petty things, petty trades that will fetch them only money for the only, only money for them to feed on, not money for them to live on. Because feeding is just once in a while. Even the feeding is not is not is even the feeding is not even sequel. The whole they eat. Some people eat once in a day. Some people eat twice in a day. It's not even it's not even balanced. Then yet these people are keep saying they want to they would they want to lead us. It is when they are it is when they are contesting that is when they give a fake promises and us they emerge as the president or whatever they do whatever they want they do whatever they wish to do. And then there is nothing there's nothing we can do because they are in power already. Not until they start having these um, feelings, they start giving they, they, they start having the respect for the citizens of the country, that is when this country will get to a better position. So my dear listeners, now we've come to the end of our today's news. Please do drop by at the comment section and let's know.